sitting on it again? There you are, my little friend. Isabel Endermy, October 31st, 11 p.m. Case analysis for experimental psychology, subject number 4999. Somnibus populis cella. The subject's diary, one may call it that, is entitled The Somnibus Populis Cella. Written in the hand of an 11-year-old, the script is surprisingly mature. But the nature and subtext of her densely collected thoughts are disconcerting. Somnibus Populis Cella. The people in the dream room. Creepy. does a pre-adolescent mind conjure images of Lovecraftian horror, especially when exposure to such dark fantasies is so limited? Are these phantoms of the mind made manifest more by tall and terrible tales? Or are the nightmares born solely from an early trauma? Perhaps it's a way for a developing psyche to manage the madness of grief giving our agony a fearsome face to fight against. By avoiding our deepest fears and denying our own pain, do we create the monsters? Or have the monsters always existed? Instead of feeding on our fears, in our minds as we sleep. Omnibus populus chella. The people in the dream room. Omnibus populus chella. The people in the dream room. Omnibus populus chella. Omnibus populus chella. But a dream within a dream. Watch new scary bits every Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday.